601 now. Computer, take me live to the floor of Consumer Electronics Show. Computer, I need Craig Figner right now. This is this is the latest in technology. Are you aware of this? Oh, it there works it is. good. I wasn't sure. Computer for came a through. Hey, buddy. Well, we are glad to be with you, and we're inside of a vehicle here. We're on the autonomous vehicle lot. There is an autonomous vehicle lot. It's a very big deal. Cars are all types of vehicles this year at the Consumer Electronics Show. Uh, we're going to show you something live here on News 3 today, and this is about a new technology, and there's a term you're going to be hearing. It's, it's V2V or V2X, uh, vehicles talking to vehicles electronically, sharing information, and then V2X is, is vehicles to everything, talking to even mobile devices. Uh, this is a test that we're going to do on the lot here and the what you're going to see and I, I'm not going to tell you what you're going to see in advance but we're going to approach uh, the driver is going to need some information that could potentially save somebody's life if this was a real world situation the picture might be a little rocky because we're doing this live in a moving vehicle uh, so give a watch here and the vehicle is going to know that there is something ahead because of a mobile device that the vehicle is talking with go ahead Let's go. Watch for pedestrian on the right. All right, so there's a person here in a black jacket, and this vehicle alerted us to that person because the vehicle is talking with his cellular telephone, his mobile device, his smartphone. Uh, imagine a world where all vehicles talk with each other electronically, whether with uh, the actual driver or with an autonomous driver. Uh, this is a world that, that a company named Safari is envisioning, and if you can believe this, General Motors is already putting this technology in all of its Cadillac models models for the current model year other automakers expected to follow uh, but again they're talking about with this technology communicating with cell phones with mobile devices cars talking to cars uh, that they could prevent up to 80 percent of all collisions between vehicles and accidents involving people incredible stuff i'm craig Finger reporting live from ces we are going to have more for you a bit later here on news three today and on our sister station the cw las vegas join us then well and craig I noticed that whenever you hear the automated voice, it always sounds so smooth and sexy. It never sounds like Rosanna, Rosanna, yes. Dana. Now that would be something if they could get that figured out. Craig, thank Indeed. you for that.